Now, your 41 NBC AccuWeather forecast, presented by Volume Chevrolet. Welcome back. We are tracking a few areas of rain still kind of lingering out across parts of middle Georgia right now. One area of showers that seems to be kind of breaking apart as it moves into our area pushing in towards Macon County. So mostly just some light rain right now. We've been staying very stable, which has meant that there isn't a lot of energy for these storms to use to kind of fire up for tonight. But we are seeing another boundary trying to push in from the southeast. So we'll see if any of these storms can stay together as they move into areas of Wheeler and Telfair County. And we could be dealing with a couple showers overnight. But check out this rainfall that we've seen over the past 24 hours. A lot of this came overnight last night into early this morning. Around three inches of rainfall over near Roberta, 1.4 near Butler, 2.5 down in Unadilla. And here in Macon at the airport, picking up 1.24 inches of rainfall. And that's just for today. We've had a lot of rain so far this month, so we're at a surplus of almost three inches of rainfall. And for the year, we're actually at a surplus of over four and a half inches of rain. So doing pretty good on our rainfall. Drought monitor came out today. No one in middle Georgia under drought. So some good news there as we try and finish out our summer. This is looking out on our 41 sky view this evening overlooking downtown Dublin, where we continue to see some relatively warm temperatures, 77 degrees right now with those mostly cloudy skies. Temperatures feeling like 78, and we could see the potential for a few isolated showers overnight. But otherwise, everybody kind of sitting in those middle 70s this evening. We're going to keep it mostly cloudy as well, even all the way into tomorrow morning. We still see a little bit of that swirl from that area of low pressure out to our west, but that's really going to start to dissipate as we're heading into the weekend. So we're going to start to move out a little bit of this weather pattern, but it just means that our summertime weather pattern is going to be moving back in. So we're heading into tomorrow morning with some mostly cloudy skies. Some isolated showers are possible to start, but it's really going to be tomorrow afternoon and evening where we're going to see the better chance for these pop up showers and storms once again. So it's going to be a lot like what we were seeing last Friday, where we did see a lot of these kind of popping up along boundaries. Saturday, how about we repeat it, but we're going to take the temperature up a couple notches back to around 90 degrees. We're going to just kind of do this all weekend before we start to see some better rain chances for next week. For the rest of this evening, though, temperatures falling into those lower 70s. You can see that closer up view of what we're expecting as we're heading into tomorrow. So some sunshine temperatures get back into the 80s throughout the day, and then we start to see more of these pop up showers and storms as we head into the evening. Heavy rain and gusty winds will be possible with any of those storms that are popping up as we're moving into tomorrow afternoon. As you take a look though at our forecast for the end of the weekend, shower chances very scattered still on Sunday, but as we're moving into next week, we get back into kind of that soupy weather, high humidity, rain chances every day. Here's where we could see some good news, though. Potential for a cold front that might drop in by the end of next week. That will continue to bring us some rain through Wednesday and Thursday, but we could start to see some drier air move in and maybe even some cooler temperatures because we're expecting 90s pretty much all of next week. In just 10 seconds, I'll look at our seven day forecast. Volume Chevrolet, good oil changes for life, plus a 20 year, 200,000 mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I 75 exit 187 in Forsyth. That's volumechevrolet.com. And here's your 41 NBC AccuWeather 7 day forecast sponsored by Volume Chevrolet. We got temperatures tomorrow in the mid 80s, scattered showers and thunderstorms possible, especially during the afternoon. But really, as we're heading into next week, 90s are on the way. More of those showers and storms likely throughout next week with a better chance even on Thursday.